Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome again to San Andreas. You may be wondering, why is this video back at my house? What is going on? I was in the middle of an OG low commission. I had just stolen a car. That I was getting, you know, a, a pay and spray. Ladies and gentlemen, this is one of the times where, you know, not doing recording with a camera like I used to from 2008 to 2012 is kind of a little bit of a detriment. My power went out. Did it go off for like five minutes? No, it went off for five hours. The stream had to end. I didn't know if I was going to be able to come back and play. And guess what? All those missions I did that last session, which was about an hour of gameplay, you know, the OG Loke, none of it counted. None of it. So I have to start over. I'm basically starting over from scratch as if I had never played today. And we're going right back to the freaking Rider mission. <laughs> so here we go. Sergeant Wumi. Cheered and said, Phil, which would you prefer to drive? A 93 Suto Toyota? We already saw that. I'm going to skip it. A 93 Suto Toyota uh, with its turbo and suspensions that make you drift like a crab or a 1964 Ford Mustang with a turbo charge? You drive, CJ. Probably the Mustang. You missed the driver. Probably the Mustang. I like the look of the Mustang. I'm not I'm not a big uh, souped up you know, Toyota guy. That's for sure. Well, don't go roll a damn car over and blow us all up in flames then. Yeah, the fuck's your problem, CJ? I'm not even looking. What's Good. your problem, CJ? Your concentrate on the road, then. Learn how to fucking drive, CJ. <laughs> Come on, CJ. He's trying to keep my soldiers alive, nigga. About nagging them to death? Watch the road, motherfucker. The road. This is great. I keep hearing stuff as he's saying this. I'm just literally smashing into everything as he says this. Yeah, here we go. That's our train, all right. Damn! Dude, that guy got fucked right there. Shit, look like some north side bagos got it first. What the fuck happened to the camera? What the- dude, the camera! Dude, the camera is retarded. It kept rotating. What in the holy hell? Oh, uh, what's this? We got ballers trying to crash the party? Look like Tim Penny told every gang in South Central. Man, we gonna smoke those ball assholes. There we go. go. Check out the train, CJ. I actually did some nice switching targets and I actually rolled, which is kind of impressive. Uh, <laughs> didn't think I was going to be able to do that. Okay. Let's do this again. There you go. Damn, what is that? Chill out, fool. We're going to be right behind you. Fallen 1570 just resubbed to the channel. So I'm glad you're box, playing Great Chair Total San Andreas again. It's one of my favorite childhood games. And my, and my favorite GTA game of all time. There you go. Oh, by the way, I'm supposed to be throwing crates. Oops. Damn, not so hard. Keep them coming. Shit, I nearly dropped that one. What the fuck? Shit bounced. Oh, shit. And another one. Okay, CJ. There we go. That's all I can carry. Now I gotta get, not get caught by the fucking cops this time. Gotta get out of here. Hop in the car and stab out, fool. Man, we got one time on our tail. Go to the pain spray and lose the cops. CJ, let's move. We got one time on them. How do I get out of here? Here we go. Here we go, here we go. What the fuck? Dude, seriously? He barely touched me. The whole car spun out. Alright, we're almost there. Certainly doing better this time.
This is the same fucking pain spray I was going to before, right? Ninja style. Yeah, ninja style. He shoots out of the pain spray. Ninja style. <laughs> All right, pain spray. I got a trophy for that. Oh shit. Mr. Swaggers actually says that he feels that, that this game is overrated. He likes it, but he thinks it's overrated. And he asks, what is my favorite GTA of all time? Uh, honestly, you know, I've played three, Vice City, San Andreas, four, and five, as well as La La uh, Liberty City Stories and Vice City Stories. I'd probably say that, Damn it, um, out of all of them, Vice City for me had the most appeal when it came to like playing it long term because of the music. Like I really like the music and the design of the game and the characters and stuff like that. The gameplay of the game, not so much. I thought the gameplay was very outdated. Um, obviously Grand Theft Auto 5 is the most modern and kind of the most fun for modern players. I really like Grand Theft Auto 4 only because it was my first Grand Theft Auto ever that I had ever played of the modern GTAs. So in that regard, like GTA 4 holds like a special place in my heart. I'm not saying that the old ones are Damn, bad. Man, I just think that is four is kind of cool because yeah, it's the first one I ever experienced. LB's coming over to stash the shit. Shout out to Insomniatic me who did 150 bit cheer to be the cheerleader for tonight. Okay, Thank you, Insomniatic. In. Orcs for dorks did a 50 bit cheer. He said I once ate a chocolate that had hurt. whiskey in it. That sounds delicious. And Johnny Soros Rex did a 50 bit cheer. He said he's sad to see that Final Fantasy IV lost the, out on the poll. Uh, but hopefully one day we'll see it. Oh, trust me, we're gonna see it one day. There's no way I'm not gonna never play it. Definitely playing it. Alright. Save up. So it doesn't even matter where I save, because like I said, I haven't saved at all that last session. Hey, at least I got the mission done this time. That's good. BWT says the Lost and Damned is good. Yeah, I actually liked the, exp the expansions for GTA 4. Both of them were actually good. I thought they were both quite good uh, DLC stories. Oh, Swaggin says, I had actually asked, why do you think that so many people think San Andreas is the best one? Well, probably because it was the most modern of the three classic GTA trilogy, you know, three, Vice City and San Andreas. So it had the most things in it to do, had the best graphics, the more, uh, you know, uh, refined controls. The music was the more modern of all of them, right? Taking place in the 90s. There's a lot of reasons. All right, Robin Uncle Sam. What is this? Hey, Rod! Low. Nah. Rod! Oh, my God. Jay? Hey, CJ. Tell me why I didn't finish high school. Ha <laughs> ha, he's so fucked. Because you've been dealing drugs, man, since the age of 10. No, that ain't it. <laughs> Could you have put hands on that teacher for wearing baller colors? <laughs> no, that ain't it either. It's cause I'm too intelligent for this shit, man. I am the real deal, fool. Oh shit. A genius. Of course. <laughs> oh, oh yeah. Who has more straps than anybody? Who has all the straps, huh? Ah, uh, a man with a lot of guns. Shit, I give up. The army, my nia. The army. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Go hit the way. Get that way. out of my face, Go hit the I way. Oh, <laughs> come on, man. Come on. Bluster. I like how CJ, he stays away from everything that's bad. He doesn't do the drugs, you know. He basically is like a, a he's, he does all these crimes, but he refuses to do drugs or do the horrible stuff that everyone else does in the game. All right, drive to the compound at Ocean Docks. Let's see what this mission is. I have no idea. You think you can roll this van without killing us both? Hey, Ryder, where we going? Ocean Docks. How we get this van? It wasn't outside when I came through. Nah. My homie LB. You trying to put that like on the G? Work ninja. Real dependable. Unlike some of you motherfuckers. Give it a rest, man. I lost my little brother, and now I lost my mom. Don't matter how much shit the city throw at you. CJ, you gotta stick by your homies. Yeah, I guess. I don't even know what I'm doing here. I'm in the wrong spot. What is this? What the fuck is this? This isn't right. No, I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'm not doing that. Go back. How the fuck do I get to where I need to go? 
shit. How do I, what do I do here? This is like a dead end. Fuck this stupid fucking fence. Fuck this shit. Get this out of here. Alright, where am I going? This way. Fuck that stupid pole. Go. Damn, I'm gonna be dent in the back of the truck. What happened? Sergeant Wumi cheered and says, I didn't have to use Tenta missiles. Today's a good day. Okay, I don't know what that means, but... Great. How the fuck do I get over here? I think I gotta keep going. I think there's maybe a way to cross over here or something. I have no idea. Or is there a bridge or something? Look. What the fuck? Where? What? How do I zoom? How the fuck? I can't zoom in on this goddamn map. What a piece of shit. I can't tell where I need to go. What is this bullshit? I have no idea where I'm going. How do I do this? Fuck. Rich just cheered. I said, would you like the next GTA to be set in the present? Ugh. It would send the present, you know, and it has a lot of modern references and a lot of mo cool, like, futuristic technology and shit. That could be cool. But, you know, the ones set in the past have a, have a special place just because they are set in the past. And so that way they can have cultural references and things for those time periods. So, I don't know. Maybe I would like to see one to go in the past. I don't know. But I think it's going to be the present because there's trilogies. Like, the, the original GTA trilogy was 3, Vice City, and, and San Andreas. So I think the next one is going to be another modern one just so it was, like, 4... Five and six. Can anybody Fuck you. in this state drive? Mr. Swang says, even to this day, a lot of people think this is the best GTA. What are my thoughts? I don't know. Like I said, I don't think the game's bad. It's certainly outdated. Um, with a lot of gameplay elements that are in it. I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do here, by the way. I'm seriously lost. What am I supposed to do? Did I go, okay, is this a bridge over here? This might be where I need to do. Okay. It's fucking confusing, dude. The map of this game is more confusing than all the other Jigger Theft Autos. It's just the design of the overworld is so weird. Bendejo. The Bendejo. Oh. Alright, I fucking made it. Good guy. 